We were looking for a challenge. We were looking for a way to push our skills and tools to their limits. We were looking for a way to create something beautiful and to elevate reality capture to a new level. Human beings have been trying to capture reality in some form or another since the beginning of time, from our earliest written records and drawings right on down to modern photography. We've sought to capture our surroundings artistically through paintings, models, and photographs. We've tried to measure our surroundings with plumb lines and measuring tapes and display our findings through exquisite draftsmanship. As we've progressed in our abilities, we've pushed unendingly for more detail, more information, and more complexity in our depictions of the built world. Today, we turn to laser scanners to create the most accurate and highly detailed records of the world as it exists around us combining beauty and functionality into one toolbox, Reality Capture. When Reality and Epic Games decided to collaborate on a project, one thing was clear. We both wanted a challenge that would force us to push the limits of our technology to their utmost and see what we could achieve with reality capture tech and cutting edge visualization software. We wanted to explore our ability to handle in one significant project, complex geometry, cultural and historical preservation and dozens of cutting edge tools. Habitat 67 met all those criteria. When it was built in 1967, it gained global recognition for its visionary design and remains a celebrated example of modernist architecture. Its unique modular structure and visually captivating design makes it an ideal subject for demonstrating the possibilities of reality capture showcasing how advanced technologies can accurately capture and recreate the intricacies of complex architectural structures. A project like this requires the right tools. It requires the right people. It requires vision. It requires a willingness to look at the world creatively and the collaboration of a team of professionals who can bring a myriad of technologies together. This is Reality Capture. Reality's role in the Habitat 67 project was to use an assortment of laser scanning devices, including terrestrial and mobile scanners, to create a high-density, accurate point cloud of the structure and its surrounding areas. To achieve this, we collected hundreds of laser scans over the course of two days. We took each scan from a unique position 
to ensure that every visible external surface of Habitat 67 would be captured in the point cloud. Habitat 67 is a challenging structure to scan because of its complex geometry. Unlike a typical apartment building, Habitat 67's floors are staggered and set back from each other, essentially creating hundreds of different levels that need to be scanned separately. Laser scanners are not like X-ray machines. They work with line of sight and have certain range limitations as well. That meant that we had to scan from hundreds of setups using our terrestrial scanners and also supplement that data using mobile mapping technology, making sure we hadn't missed any portions of the building. The P-50 was useful in this project because it has such high accuracy of scanned data, even at incredible long ranges. And then the RTC-360 gave us the capture and imaging speeds necessary for such a large project. Because of all the nooks and crannies, the small size of the BLK-360 was also very useful. But adding in the BLK to go scans that are done while walking filled in a lot of gaps from the stationary scanners. The smart lift roof from Scan and Go gave our P50 scanner extra height and mobility. Combining that with the level plane meant that we could level the scanner remotely and move quickly from setup to setup around the perimeter of Habitat 67. The WIPI scan helped us to move from one setup to another with the P50 when we couldn't access scan areas with the scanner on a vehicle. The extra height and mobility of the WIPI scan accelerated our workflow on site. The uplift from Scan and Go raised the scanners to a height that allowed us to see above some of the terraces on the structure. This amount of scanning to do, the BLK to go back back from Scan and Go enabled us to scan hands-free and saved our arms. In some dark areas, it was useful to have extra lighting as well, using Scan & Go's BLK2GO light kit. After days of scanning, a lot of work still remained, all those scans needed to be processed. We imported all the data from all those different scanners into just one software. Once it was all aligned and put together, it was easy to move into Cyclone 3DR and Point Fuse. And of course into Reality Capture from Epic Games, where a final combined 3D model was created. It was such a thrill to contribute to this project. Montreal is reality's hometown, so taking part in this collaboration about an iconic piece of the Montreal skyline means a lot. Reality Capture allows us to transcend the limits of our memory. It freezes moments in time and space. Generations from now, some of these snapshots may allow virtual archaeologists to experience the world as it exists today. The possible applications for this technology are practically limitless, and the story of reality capture is only just beginning.